my name is Patty Helms. I have been going to Bridgeport since 1980 uh, with my husband. Um, we have been longtime supporters of the track. Periodically during the season, Bridgeport holds special races. Uh, this past Wednesday, June 12th, they had a Night of Wings featuring the 410 sprint cars. My husband and I would have been there, except for the fact our granddaughter was graduating from eighth grade. Um, Jason Leffler, who had just recently run Bridgeport the Sunday before, I mean uh, Pocono in the NASCAR, came to Bridgeport to run his sprint car. Uh, they ran qualifying time trials, which he was doing over 130 miles an hour, and then they started running the heat race, which is standard for positioning in the feature race. Um, something happened as he came out of turn four, some mechanical issue, and the car went into the wall, rolled several times, and unfortunately claimed Jason's life. The, the fatal crash was, was tragic to a lot of people, family, friends, the whole racing community, but even more so to his five-year-old son, Charlie. The last four days have been very difficult here at Bridgeport Speedway. Wednesday night, we had a special racing program with the 410 sprint cars joining us here at the Speedway. And as we all know, a very tragic event occurred with the passing of Jason Leffler. This past Saturday night, we went to the track uh, for the regular Saturday night race. And before the races, they, they did do a moment of silence remembering Jason. They were also selling these decals which we purchased um, and all the proceeds were, are going towards uh, Charlie's education fund. Bridgeport raised over eleven hundred dollars probably would have done a whole lot more except they ran out of stickers. Surrounding tracks, New Egypt Speedway, Grandview Speedway, they also were selling um, tribute stickers to Jason again trying to raise money for his son.